Alright, I'm incredibly annoyed by this fucking noise. We're gonna go check it out. What is that? Who the fuck is it? Stop knocking, you asshole. Christ. Fucking annoying. <laughs> I'm so scary, it's annoying. Stop. Alright, close this. Back into the house. The fuck? Open this goddamn door! I should open this fucking door! Right now! Ram it! Ram it with my cock! Ram it! Door doesn't fucking open. Bullshit, now what do I do? I gotta go back down to the fucking basement? Can't do anything here. Ooh, lightning. By the way, why is it pitch black outside? It, like, not even 40 minutes ago when I started playing this game, it was fucking full sunlight. Now it's pitch black like it's a midnight and pouring rain. Here, can I call someone? Try again. Nope. All right, let's go back down then. Watch this. Who's knocking? Who was it? Who's not? Oh, I can't run. They won't let me. They artificially made me walk slow. Hello. It's the wife, but she's infected. Yep. Look at that. She's infected. Whoa! She tossed my ass. Holy shit! Whoa! You got a knife. Oh, fuck! Oh! Oh! God damn it! Oh! Through the hand! Through the fucking hand! Oh my god! Wait! Wait! Oh, Jesus Christ! Nuts! Whoa! Do something here, stop her! Well... Stupid bitch! I can hear her. I can feel her clawing her way back inside of me. Get out! Leave me alone! There's gotta be a variation of the the T virus. I deserve this. Oh my god! Knocks herself out. Jesus. Use a first aid med. Oh, that's how you that's how you solve getting stabbed through the fucking hand, right? <laughs> In real life, oh, I just put some peroxide on that fucking gaping wound, you know. My hand split down the fucking middle, waggling around like a slab of fucking disgusting, gushing blood meat. Oh, I put some fucking alcohol on there. I'm good. Great. We've entered the realm of fantasy now, after three years. My first tea bag, yes! Ah, that's what you get for stabbing me, bitch. Yes, smell my ass. I had two burritos before I got here. All right. Anyway, she's knocked the fuck out. Anyway, she's <laughs> she's done. Does this door open now? No. Still doesn't open. My initial guess is that this is a, a new variation of the virus from Resident Evil. And it's different now. Instead of turning you into a zombie, it turns you into, like, a homicidal killer. That could be maybe mind-controlled, possibly. What the fuck? <laughs> Holy shit. She knocked the whole wall down. Holy fuck. Grabbed an axe. And my axe. I can never leave. Holy fuck. Oh my god. I don't want to kill her. I might have to. Oh! God damn. Oh yes, very nice. She dead? <clears throat> Damn, that was brutal. That was fucking brutal. 
Oh, some dirty tissues. Oh, now the phone rings. The fuck kind of room was this? She threw me into this fucking room. God damn. I wonder if I completely screwed up and I can't go in the attic or anything now because I didn't do the other stuff in the house earlier. <clears throat> Who's on the phone? Yes, uh, Kim Jong-un, he's been on hold, sir. We've been waiting for you. You really shouldn't have come here. Who's this? And what the fuck is going on? My name's Zoe. There should be a way out through the attic. Attic? Go there. Now. Alright, so we're almost done. We just get through the attic. The game's over. What the fuck was that noise? Sounded like another door opened. What the fuck? She's gone! She didn't die. I was gonna say, so... Is it not like zombies from Resident Evil where you can just, like, kill them like normal people? Nope, she's not dead. She's still alive. <clears throat> well, the door opened. The question is, where do I get the fuse? Right? I need the fuse to put in here so I can get into the attic. There's no fuse. Where the fuck is it? Yeah, I don't have it. Huh. I gotta find a fuse somewhere. You know what I could do? I could cut open the, the chain on the, the, the cabinet in the front. Because I have the bolt cutter now. Sounds good. I still don't have the key to get in there. Nope. <clears throat> Fuck it! That didn't work. Okay, bolt cutters. Let's see what we got here. The fuse! Who's the asshole who keeps taking the fuse out of the fuse box and hiding it randomly in the house somewhere? Oh, look! Go, get her! Kill this bitch. She disappeared, of course. Here we go. <clears throat> now it should work. See stairs. All right. Oh Jesus! It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. It's me. I just got a big gash. What's in her hand? What's in her hand? I knew it. You shouldn't have done that. I knew it. Kill her. It's fucking her. Oh my god, again! This is the second time she impaled my left hand! You bitch! You fucking bitch! Get the screwdriver out of my goddamn hand! Get the screwdriver out of my hand! What the fuck? You got a chainsaw! Oh shit, get it out! Get it out! Hurry up! Whoa! Oh! No hand! Holy fuck! Oh my god! Oh look, I put some alcohol on it. It'll it'll keep grow back. I promise. You fucking bitch! Alcohol. Put some alcohol on it. There you go. Make it grow back. Look at that. It's coming right back right now. Wait a minute. Oh shit! <laughs> Grab your severed hand. Oh my god. Grab your severed hand. This is great. Come here, bitch. I'm gonna bleed all over you, you fucking bitch. Squirt around like a nut. I'm gonna be like the guy from uh, Monty Python. The Black Knight. You know, his arms and legs chubbed off and he fucking bleeds on him. How about you? Ha! Huh? Fighting with nubs. <clears throat> this is great. By the way, he'd be dead. He'd be bleeding out. You need to find a way to suture the wound and pouring fucking peroxide on it ain't gonna cut it. Hate to tell you, brother. Hate to tell you, bro, you're done. Oh, handgun ammo and a handgun, great. Shoot with one hand. Okay, fine. Fine, I'll shoot you, bitch. This is quite funny.
Bullets. I still have a first aid somehow, even though I used it. I got my severed hand. You're lucky I cut off by Mia. It's still warm. Great. Oh. I get the feeling this is all just the intro to the game, by the way. Fuck you. Fuck you looking at, bitch. God damn. Oh my god, he hit so hard it exploded. He hit the fucking mannequin so hard it ripped it to a million pieces. Jesus. Anything else in here? I don't see anything. <clears throat> okay. Poor Ethan Mars. He really has been through the fucking ringer. One kid killed, another kid kidnapped. Serial killer he has to stop. In Scott Shelby. Wife fucking basically won't leave him alone at the fucking police station because he lost the kid. Then he divorces his wife, gets married again. This wife chops off his fucking hand. Christ. What kind of a fucking world is this? Poor Ethan Mars can't be left alone. Fuck this. Fuck your boxes. The fuck you looking at? Fuck you. Piece of shit. By the way, I just realized he pulled the screwdriver out of his out of his hand. He doesn't have it. He doesn't have it with him. I thought maybe he'd have it. I'd be able to go open the drawer in the kitchen, but he doesn't have it with him. I fucking hate boxes. Well, there it is. I'm not. I'm not falling for that shit. Ah, a new room. Totally new. More ammo. Freaking boxes. Freaking boxes, making copies. Ten civil rights leaders and not to not to get angry at Donald Trump. Wonder if anyone will get that reference. <clears throat> so, oh, I guess I just gotta leave, right? Maybe I'll make one quick final pass through the house. Just to make sure I didn't miss anything. <clears throat> I like how this guy's still not passed out from pain or dead or anything. He's still fine. Oh, I can save my game again. I should probably save my game again. Here we go. God damn. All right. <clears throat> Let me make sure that screwdriver is not down here. Maybe when I took it out of my hand, it's down here somewhere. On the floor. Where did he throw it? What did he do with it? After his hand got chopped off, what did he do with the screwdriver? Because it's weird that he can't open that drawer in the kitchen. Blood there. I don't see it anywhere. He tossed it, but... No. I don't think it's here. I thought maybe it would have landed somewhere random and you need to find it and open the drawer, but I don't see it anywhere. No. Fuck that clock. Nothing else? No. Alright, fuck this. Unless I can get it open with my fucking axe, which I doubt. I have nothing that'll open it. Unless I shoot it. Darn, there's gotta be something in there, too. It sucks. Oh, I didn't even notice this. He turned off the dripping faucet because he's, he's green. He wants to conserve water. That's right. Very important. Can he just go out the way he came? Or did they lock the door on him here? 
They locked the door on him. Okay, that's why he has to go out the attic. <clears throat> All right. So, I don't see a key to get into that drawer. I guess we're just going to go back up to the attic and escape. I don't see anything else you can do here. Okay. <clears throat> so, getting out of the, the initial house here and uh, on to the rest of the game, I guess. I'm assuming probably what's going to end up happening, we're going to go to that mansion that we saw. And that'll be good because that'll be all new. <clears throat> Nothing that I've seen previously. Oh, she's there with the chainsaw. Yeah! Yeah, baby! Massacre time! Oh my god. Oh, fuck you. I've had enough of this shit. Fuck you! Bitch! Suck it! In the head. Fuck off. Eat some bullets. Oh god. How many headshots does it take to kill this bitch? Oh my god, her face! Oh yeah? Oh! Jesus Christ! She doesn't die! Holy fuck! I killed her! Pick up the chainsaw! Why can't you pick it up? God damn, took so many headshots. Now's a good time to start searching boxes. Nothing in them. Well, fuck oh, God! Where did he come from? Then he fucking curb stops you. What a bastard. Trophy, welcome to the family, son. So what, now you're kidnapped, just like she was. She's probably gonna infect you. Yeah, he put you in the mansion, look. What the fuck is going on? You may wonder, why is this guy so tough that he's so... He was able to get his hand stabbed repeatedly and then his hand chopped off and he's fine. It's because he's a coke junkie. He's a Wall Street uh, stockbroker. He's always hopped up on coke. What the fuck? How did his hand back? Huh? He had his hand back. How is this possible? Uh... When you're a Wall Street stockbroker, you're so hopped up on heroin and coke and shit all the time, you don't feel nothing, man. Nothing. It's a life of extremes. Hmm. Where, where am I? What the hell? It's the family. It's time for supper. Oh, oh, yummy. Who are all you people? Where's Mia? Family of zombies. Eat it. It's good. Dumb son bitch wasn't no good if it hit him. Somebody has a hand back. Doesn't make sense. Oh, look. Tip got to eat. He got to have supper. Come here, boy. Oh, this looks good. This is a delicacy in, in uh, Taiwan. <laughs> Marguerite. This was supposed to be a very special feast. Mmm. Oh boy. Fucking cock giblets. Okay. The fuck's he doing? God damn it. I'll bet it's that cop again. I like how he's fine that he got his arm chopped off. <laughs> I'm coming back for you. 
Okay. Oh, hello, Granny. Are you still alive? How the fuck does he have his hand back? It doesn't make any sense. All my inventory is gone. Whoa, he's got a health meter now. And somehow his fucking hand is back. How does it, that makes no sense at all, dude. Well, escape from the house. Nice air conditioner. They may be zombies, but they need it at a nice, cool 70 degrees Fahrenheit every day. Hello? What the fuck? Again, what's with the chairs getting stuck on feet? Look. Get the fucking chair around. <laughs> Kick that shit. Alright, I just want to look around. What's this? <clears throat> Nico's Hardware. Saw a rope and a pet collar. He bought 20 pet collars. What the fuck? Jesus. Where's my money? Has nobody seen my... Can't read the last word. Dead by Dawn. Dead, dead, dead. Dead by Dawn is a reference to... Uh, fucking uh, Evil Dead. Where's my... Oh, has no one seen my leg? Has nobody seen my leg? Ha <laughs> ha! Something is not dead. The birthday? I can't read it. The handwriting's terrible. Well, I guess we're gonna check out the digs. It's, uh, zombie cribs. Resident Evil crazy redneck family zombie cribs. Sounds good. 